What is VoIP? So that is the topic of this video. Now VoIP stands for Voice Over Internet Protocol. And this is exactly what it does. It's a technology that allows you to make phone calls over an internet connection instead of over standard telephone lines. And the main reason for the development of VoIP is to keep up for today's business needs for a flexible, inexpensive, and a more convenient way to make phone calls. Now, before VoIP, people would make phone calls the old-fashioned way, which is by using traditional landlines where communications use PSTN, or Public Switched Telephone Network. So you would have a telephone, and then you would use that telephone to dial a number, and then through an electronic switch, you would be connected to the other person. But VoIP is different. VoIP doesn't use telephone lines. Instead, it uses a standard broadband internet connection that you would typically have in a home or business. So what do you need to use VoIP? Well, in order to use VoIP, you need to have a VoIP service provider, an internet connection, a router or switch, and a VoIP phone. So then you would plug in the phone into your router or switch using a network cable, sign up with a VoIP provider, and then once that's complete, you can now make phone calls over an internet connection. Now a VoIP phone looks similar to a traditional landline, but the main difference is that a VoIP phone uses an internet connection, while a landline uses a phone line connection. So a VoIP phone would have an RJ45 port for an ethernet network cable, and a landline has a standard RJ11 phone port that uses a phone cable. Now, realistically, you really don't need a VoIP phone because you can still use a landline instead, but you would have to use a special VoIP adapter like this one here, where you would plug your landline into the phone port, and then from your router or switch, you would plug a network cable into the internet port. Or if you don't want to even use a hardware phone, you can use what's called a soft phone. A soft phone is an application that you download and install on your computer, tablet, or smartphone that enables you to make phone calls over the internet. So basically, it's software that allows your devices to act like a phone. So how does VoIP work? Well, whenever you want to make a phone call using VoIP, you would just pick up the receiver and then dial the number of the person you want to talk to, just like a landline. Or if you're using a soft phone, you would just open up the application and then type in the number. Now the way a VoIP call is initialized is by using a protocol called SIP, which stands for Session Initiation Protocol. So SIP is what does all the work behind the scenes when starting a VoIP call. And one of the main things that SIP does is mapping phone numbers to IP addresses. So it's similar to how DNS works, where domain names such as google.com is mapped to an IP address. So when you dial a number, SIP will find the matching IP address of the recipient to locate and connect the call. And then after the connection has been made, as you speak into the microphone, your voice is converted from an analog signal to a digital signal using a technology called ADC, or Analog to Digital Converter. And then that digital signal is encapsulated into small chunks called data packets. And this is done by using a protocol called RTP, which stands for Real-Time Transfer Protocol which is a standard protocol for the transmission of audio and video data over a network. The data packets will then travel across the internet using RTP, and then will route the data packets to the person you are calling. And then once the data packets arrive, it'll reassemble those packets so the recipient can hear and understand your message. So what are the benefits of VoIP? Well, for one, convenience because you just need an internet connection, a VoIP provider, and a VoIP phone. Or, as I stated before, you don't even have to have a handset because you can just use a soft phone. And that leads us to our next benefit, which is saving money. Because most people will already have an internet service, and they will already have internet devices, such as a computer, tablet, or smartphone. And in addition, having a VoIP service also eliminates the need to install a PBX, or Private Branch Exchange, which is an internal telephone network that allows you to make phone calls, which is extremely expensive. 
So instead, you can use a virtual PBX provided by a VoIP provider. And VoIP also saves a lot of money when making long distance and international phone calls. And another benefit is having a lot of advanced features, such as conference calling, call recording, call analytics, logs, voicemail, auto attendant, monitoring, and more. Another benefit is flexibility, because as I stated before, most people will already have internet access, and that alone makes it extremely flexible for businesses and their employees to make calls because that allows them to do their job from just about anywhere. Now, there are some disadvantages of VoIP, and one of those is power outages. So if you lose power, VoIP services will not work. Another disadvantage is that VoIP relies on a reliable and stable internet connection. So if the internet connection has some stability issues, the quality of the audio will be poor. And also, VoIP may not work with certain alarm security systems. So if you want to make sure that your home security system works, you need to check with your security company to see which VoIP providers are compatible. Hey guys, speaking of security, I want to tell you about Aura. Now, Aura is what I personally use to protect my identity. And this is because, as most of you know, today almost everything about you is available on the internet. And this information is accessible because of data brokers who profit by selling your information to robocallers, telemarketers, spammers, and anybody else who wants to learn more about you. And certain people can use that information against you. But Aura quickly goes to work to remove your personal information from the internet. And it'll alert you within minutes if your credit file has been compromised. And in addition to protecting your identity, Aura also protects your devices. The app has an antivirus, password manager, parental controls, and a super fast VPN so you can surf the internet safely and anonymously. So now you can try Aura for two weeks absolutely free by clicking my link in the description below, or you can just scan the QR code on the screen. And during those two weeks, you can see for yourself how many data brokers are sharing your personal information.